What's up everyone, Christian here with Modified Gaming, bringing you episode 16 of Super Luigi World. I had to think about that a bit because it's been almost a year since I've uploaded episode 15 on YouTube. And if you guys want to check out episode 15 and anything before that, you'll notice that I mentioned that you can actually go in through Bowser's Castle through the back door. What this does, it cuts through all the BS from the beginning of the level, and it takes you straight to the end, so you fight Bowser as fast as possible. But again, the only way to get there is to take all the secret exits, so if you want to check out episode 15 and everything before that, click on the playlist below, or all the annotations that you can find on this video, and it will take you back there so you can start from the beginning, because as I said already, it's been a long time since I've uploaded, and while you're at it, smack that like button on this video, and don't forget to hit the little bell annotation so you get notified every time I upload a new video, because old and new fans know that not even I know when I'm gonna upload, so it's probably best on your part to hit that little bell, because I'm gonna be uploading every single day leading up to the new year for this let's play to finally be finished because that was one of my goals that i said i was gonna do that i was gonna finally finish this let's play and i'm gonna do it i'm finally motivated just how i'm gonna finish bowser unfortunately i'm mini luigi here i'm needing a mushroom because if i get hit one time by those fans i'm gonna be dead this is the first time actually that we see this Bowser balloon in the video game and it's been turned into an iconic thing. You can see it anywhere, ranging from Super Mario Kart to other future Mario titles. And Bowser has a distinct look in this game. I just love this final battle, it's so cool. You hit him twice with those little Kooplings and as you see, the battle mechanics are gonna change. Watch out for this fire though, because if it hits you, you're donezo. Thankfully, it's a simple pattern. It goes from one side of the screen to the next. They disappear and they keep flowing. So there's Princess Peach. She needs our help. Luckily, she gives us a mushroom. So if she helps us, we got to help her. So this is the second part of the battle. Now the balloon is moving slightly up and down. Bowser's going to be a little faster, going to be tougher to hit. And he's going to drop some cannonballs that you got to avoid. If those hit you, you also take damage. It's simple Mario mechanics. But this is my favorite Super Mario game. I've said that millions of times. If you know me, and every time I've been asked this question, what's my favorite game? Hell, what's my... Yeah, my favorite game of all time has to be between this and probably Halo 3. You know, there's just nothing that compares to this. No Mario game that compares to this for me. So that's the first time I hit him during the second mechanic. Shoots another cannonball, and after that, he's going to start shooting out the little Kooplings. And I guess not. <laughs> see, see, this is what happens when you do post-commentary. It's tough because you don't really know what's going on, especially that it's been so long. Then you also just got to ad-lib stuff. So, But I love it. I think if I were to do this again, I would like to do it live. If I ever stream, I'm going to stream it live. But that's the second time I hit him. So now he's going to disappear again. And don't be afraid. Once he comes to the screen like that, he can't hurt you. The only thing that can hurt you again are these fireballs. Sometimes they're a little harder to avoid than others. This one was pretty easy. So now Princess Peach is gonna come back and she's gonna plead her help one more time. She's gonna plead her case. Luckily, she gives us another mushroom. And this is the third and final mechanic to this battle. You see the Bowser balloon turn evil. Its eyes are glowing red. It reminds me of Red Eyes Black Dragon. He's gonna throw out some little Kooplings and this time it's a little harder to aim the Kooplings, but if you're an experienced gamer like myself, you get hit by Bowser, as I'm saying that. But luckily, I had that second mushroom. Oh my god, so much saliva up in my throat. And hopefully, this will be the last hit! There we go. Bowser is done. He farted at the end. He lets Princess Peach go. And we're about to do the unthinkable. Mario is going to hate us for this. Check this out. Oh my god. Princess Peach, what are you doing? She is so unfaithful. She just kissed Mario's brother, Luigi. Can you believe this? This is actually what I set up all along. <laughs> Luigi's adventure is over. Luigi, Princess, Yoshi, everyone is very happy. We got fireworks going off in the background. This was such an amazing ending back in the 90s when I was playing this game. But originally, I did it with Mario. But this time, I can finally say that I completed... 
Super Mario World as Luigi, as I like to call it, Super Luigi World. First ever Super Luigi World done on YouTube completed. Or is it? Guess we're, we're, guess we're gonna have to find out. We got Princess Peach on top of Yoshi being led by Luigi with a bunch of 5k Pokemon Go eggs behind them. Hopefully they hatch some generation two Pokemon babies there because that has been tough. Let me tell you. Shout out to program director Toshihiko Nakago. These names I'm gonna completely botch, but I'm not even gonna bother reading the names. I have read this end screen so many times. So please go ahead and pay respects to everyone that's been a part of this game. Everyone that's with us here and not with us now, or that was with us but not with us anymore. Being said that, I do wanna say, oh man, this, this really hit home. You know, I have, I have a Star Wars poster behind me, Empire Strikes Back, and that poster means a lot to me, you know? I was never much of a Star Wars fan, even though I went to go see Revenge of the Sith when that came out, but that was mainly it. I didn't really know much about the lore, but that poster I got in 2010 when I went to Celebration 5 in Orlando with my friend Chris from Crisscross Media. If you aren't subscribed to Crisscross Media, go do that right now, but in that poster, it was a recreation of an Empire Strikes Back poster, but using Hasbro action figures. Now, oh man, it's just, I can't believe it. But I just want to say, rest in peace, Carrie Fisher. Rest in peace to her mother who passed away the day after her, Debbie Reynolds. Thank you. Thank you for everything you gave to us in this world, for inspiring countless people and for continuing the legend and may the force be with you always and one day we will all be together so that with that being said that's gonna wrap up this episode i do want to say that we're gonna have that i'm gonna have two more episodes following this one so again if you haven't hit the notification bell please do that now episode 17 will be with a special guest and number 18 will be with another special guest, and that will be the last two episodes of Super Luigi World. So please stay tuned for that. And again, they're going to be uploaded day after day after day, leading up to the end of the year, so I can reach my goal of completing this Let's Play before the new year began. Oh man, still hitting, still hitting home. Sorry about that. Sorry. But yeah, I hope you guys are excited. I don't know what the future is going to hold for Modified Gaming. With work being the way it is and my schedule being the way it is, this episode I'm kind of pushed on time. I don't know if I'm going to... Oh, I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to be be late at work. So if you're seeing this video, I'm definitely late for work. So please, if you haven't already, if you've made it here this long, throw a like on this video. Show your support. Subscribe to Modified Gaming if you like what you saw. I have countless other videos on here if you'd like to check those out. I also have videos with Crisscross Media, so go check that out as well. Subscribe over there. You know, you won't be disappointed. If you guys have been paying attention at the end of the screen, all the bosses, all the mini bosses, all the enemies have been featured. So there's Reznor, the Rhino. We've defeated him a couple times. Followed up next by the Mecha Koopas. So those were actually the things that Bowser was throwing out. I'm sorry. I'm correcting myself now. Those were Mecha Koopas that were being thrown out by Bowser. There's Bowser and all those little babies. You got them all right there in their glory. And that wraps up Super Luigi World. Stay tuned for the bonus episodes. I'm Christian. This is Modified Gaming. Peace out.